see by the dawn's early light what so proudly we hailed had the twilight's last gleaming. Dignitaries celebrated completing the installation of a $115 million concrete barrier wall during a ceremony held on Center Hill Dam's work platform in Lancaster, Tennessee, May 18, 2015. They commemorated the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers' Nashville District Project and the teamwork it took to form the underground wall through the dam's embankment to stop potentially harmful seepage from making its way through the foundation. This is a beautiful lake. We love this place, and this is an an important project here to get done. Um, it provides a lot of jobs, a lot of recreation, and it's just plain gorgeous. The concrete barrier wall is approximately two and a half feet thick, constructed vertically along the embankment in overlapping rectangular columns as deep as 308 feet from the top of the dam and deep into solid rock. Its installation showcased state-of-the-art equipment and demonstrated current technologies used to excavate and repair the dam. Deep foundation barrier walls are very complex projects to execute. Conceptually, they sound simple. Just drill a hole and fill it with concrete down 300 feet. But as uh, we've uh, found through the design process and the execution, it's a very challenging, complex project that uh, very few contractors in the world are even capable of executing. And we are very fortunate to have Bauer Foundation uh, uh, bid on the project and ultimately awarded the project. And they proved to be uh, a world leader when it comes to drilling 300 feet shafts and filling it with concrete, creating a wall. With the completion ceremony, it's a testimony to the engineering and the perseverance and the dedication both of the district team, many of which are sitting here in the audience today, as well as the engineers and uh, the crew uh, with Bauer that executed the work. The work to rehabilitate the dam began in 2012 with a first bite ceremony and continued nearly non-stop until the contractor, Bauer Foundation Corporation, placed the last concrete in March 2015. The project manager for Bauer lauded his workforce for their invaluable contributions during the restoration. None of, the, none of this equipment would have meant anything if we hadn't had experts to operate it and been able to uh, execute this work and put that machinery to its best purpose. We've been able to produce a wall that isn't, is not in fact two feet thick, it's more like two and a half feet thick. The deviations have been so slight as to be almost unmeasurable at times. So in fact, what we're sitting on here is something that's a little bit better than we all plan to build. This is the second of three major contracts to remediate the Center Hill project. The third and final contract is expected to be advertised later this year to install a concrete berm downstream of the auxiliary dam embankment. It was built on the same type of rock, has the same type issues, and our plan is to, we just recently got approval on in Washington to place a large concrete reinforcing berm downstream of that. The lake will continue to be operated at current levels until the third phase of work is completed. Officials plan to raise the lake level in time for the 2018 recreation season. This is Lee Roberts reporting for the Nashville District at Center Hill Dam in Lancaster, Tennessee.